kidding. Um, so today will be a two-part video. Part one, remelting, remelting soft plastic to make soft plastic glues, which I filmed before this, so you'll see a different intro. And part two, upgrading my swim bait or my um soft plastic making area outside. So my intros are normally quite long, so this one will be something new. See you in the video. Remelting plastics, pretty much the basic setup is just your molds. And I upgraded the clamps instead of or bands that work so much better. Got my injector, you can use a double injector and or single. And then you got some old plastic. And then you got your microwave. So yeah, pretty standard. You got your gloves, your mask, and you just gonna pop it in there. I'm gonna give it three minutes and go from there. Because if I burn the plastic in this cup, I will need to get a new one. And that's not epic. Alright, so starting, we're just going to see. Not quite. We're going to just go 30 seconds at a time now. Hope for the best. Alright, yeah. so I put it in for about a minute after the last clip. And it's about ready, so I'm going to reposition this bad boy. This. All right, and then I'm gonna get this glove and hope to God that I don't burn my phone. And yes, right. so I got the mold. I hope you can see this well. I also hope I don't burn my foot. Just get this thing going, all right, and then just get some of this stuff. And then this one has a cavity for each, or a hole for each cavity, which is kind of weird, but it's all right. Oh, all right, that one's full, and... That one's full. And then this one has three cavities in it, so... This one we might need two to get the rest out. Ooh, it's hot. Alright. Oh, now I gotta save my phone from this liquid. It's in plastic. Oh! Alright. Alright, your favorite part of the video. Grand reveal. these guys pretty nice color from just random things you know I'm just gonna get them off of here and I'll trim up later but let's feel for air bubble alright and <laughs> well I guess that guy did the grand review for me Mondo Loaders, buddy. Website coming soon. Get some for yourself, your friends, your family. Okay, so part two of this video for making, for upgrading the setup. We'll have, we'll use our ladder, hair cord, and tarp. And the plan is to just so when it rains, it gets all this stuff crappy. So we're gonna just go down like that and make it like a, so it goes off. The, the water lands on the tarp, slides down over here. And if it's hot, this will make some nice shape. This is the sketchy part. Then we're gonna take our cord. And we're gonna 
and see what is most powerful. Okay, because there's actually a little thing right here. This metal thing, not even a cord. I'm just gonna take it and then pull the line down so we can make adjustments. We're gonna give ourselves plenty of rope, so I'm just gonna let them out. And we're just gonna make a cut right there. So we're just getting the lay of the land. Okay. Okay, I don't know how well you're gonna be able to see this part, but so what my idea is is have this wrap around there, all this stuff nice and cozy, and then tie it as high up as I can get it because this is out. This is pretty big. So and I will be using the basic arbor knot if they're not one might find themselves using a lot to tie their line onto their stool on their roof. So it's really useful. Okay, so after a quick trial and error bit, this is how I've done it. So, sort of like a pulley system. I was originally just gonna tie two arbor knots, but then upon seeing how I could do it, I ended up at first having a ton of extra slack right here, but been able to pull this one to adjust it. So I untied it so I get no slack and tied it down to this thingy and boom I can pull it up and, a, and then tie another knot and yeah so we're gonna get on to the next knot all right so I went ahead and got a rope there now I'm about to make the second thing and then the adjustments will happen because I'm sure this isn't gonna play out in the first round finish i didn't get the rest on camera because it was boring and i couldn't find an angle i didn't actually end up changing the top there is a little crack here that's okay because i don't work right here i work right here i'm gonna get a little chair so if you're wondering how i did the bottom if you go around i, I did the same mechanic in a way so i grabbed been said i grabbed this middle one Grab the middle one, tied a knot, took it down, ow, wrapped it around the bottom a few times, and tied an arbor knot. And, so that's how I did it for this side. And, if you're wondering, why is that there? Well, I have all this room now, and this is protected. So, I did the same thing that I did over there. And then, I took the corner one, found this thing, rolled it through there, pulled it tight, 
and then wrapped it around with the other wrap from the other side. So I have two wraps there. Now I can have all my gear down here and have room up here. Now this is epic. I love this. Thanks for watching. I should be releasing my company soon, hopefully. And yeah, so this is a great, very fun for me to make. Not going to be fun to edit. And yeah, see you later.